The Cadillac CT6 has one of the most advanced structures on the planet. It combines 11 different materials to give it the ride quality, sound quality and of course the handling desired to compete with the world's elite luxury cars. It's also powered by a 3 litre twin turbo V6 engine. Now it needs that power to not only ferry the car around and give it decent performance, but also to carry the 34 speakers you'll find in the cabin. Hot on the heels of the Coupe GLE comes a more traditional two-box design. Now whilst most of the powertrains carry over, the big news is the plug-in hybrid. 114 horsepower electric motor and a twin-turbo V6 engine give it a net output of 346 horsepower. Now that is very good. At the other end, of course, I need say no more than 577. That's the amount of horsepower the GLE 63S puts under its hood. The Lexus RX is the personification of the brand. Now this time around it gets more style, although it won't be to everybody's cup of tea. 30 more horsepower, more space and more technology. Notably a 12.3 inch touchscreen that looks after the infotainment system. The one thing that does not change however, it's the manner in which it promises to pamper its riders. And that's exactly what the RX is known for. Jaguar's all-new XF is 120 kilograms lighter and 28% stiffer thanks to its all-new aluminum chassis. It also gets two V6 engines to start. However, down the road, look for a V8 and a long overdue diesel. The interior highlight has to be the new infotainment system. It uses a quad-core processor and a solid-state hard drive to deliver its data quickly. Now that promises to be a marked improvement because the outgoing system well, it was famous for being truculent.